as a parent, if, if you were my son today talking to me this way, I would tell you, look, do yourself a favor. Do yourself a favor. Don't drop out of your studies, but you can do on the side, you can do whatever you makes you happy, whatever you feel, you know, you'd like to see. And inshallah, I want to just say one more thing. We see our brothers and sisters struggle across the globe. It's our duty to do whatever we can to help them. On condition that whatever we do doesn't make the matter worse. That condition, a lot of people don't really think about it. They just do anything and everything. And sometimes, sometimes they make matters worse. So we need to remember while doing something that would be helping them, we shouldn't do something that would make matters worse. Right? It's my duty. I don't want you to drop out completely from your studies simply because you want to help here. But I hear what you're saying and I feel it and I don't want you to leave this either. So I want you to continue with your studies. It's just a few years. Agreed. If you start slowly sowing the seeds of this, Allah might grant it development before you finish. Or when you are done, you may want to now close that chapter and come and concentrate on this. Or by that time, you may have a different idea in your mind that might be more beneficial. Do you get my point? So inshallah, Allah make it easy for you. I hope that you don't drop out your studies. Like you say, your parents are important people in your life, be they Muslim or not. And it's not something unreasonable that they're asking you to do. The Quran says when they ask you to do something unreasonable, then you don't obey them. But if they've asked you to do something reasonable and you know what, it's not in disobedience of Allah, then you should be listening to what they have to say. So inshallah, I pray that you can further your studies and you know, pass with flying colors, good grades, whatever your field is. And at the same time, I pray that Allah use you to assist those who are struggling and suffering across the globe in the best possible way. And inshallah, may Allah use all of us to do the same. Jazakumullah khair.